to learn school online today's video for javascript boleans so first time starting coding i describe you what is a javascript boolean javascript boolean javascript boolean is a primary primitive data type in javascript boolean can have only two values true or false it is useful in controlling program flow using conditional statement like if do well or this condition statement are using by boolean true or false well now i starting the part of coding then you know what is a javascript booleans now i'm starting the coding part of javascript boolean so you know that what is a boolean in javascript I'm starting with the JavaScript. And I'm defining one age variable. Now I'm using the conditional operator in this JavaScript boolean. If the age is 24. Less than 24. If the age is less than 24, then console log you are a boy, and you also are in this. And in else condition, I'm put. it folds now see console you are a man now see the result in my browser and one more thing please subscribe Now see what is the result of this code. I refresh once and I inspect this because I console the result, so I need to inspect this. Now see you are a boy and you are also a teenager. Now see the var variable age is 15 which is and in this condition i put if age is less than 24 so this is condition true if i put the age is 28 so now this condition is false and this condition is true now see you are a man and if i would 15 I put 30. So in this case, the age is the uh, age is 13 is not less less than is 24. Now in this case, the, uh, the JavaScript if uh, if operator uh, condition is not taking this part, it print this like that. This in, in this case. This condition is true. So now I'll show you the second example of the boolean. Now see, this is a basic true and false boolean true and false example. Now I show you something um, other things in the boolean basic. Now see, this is a basic boolean logic and or and not. This is the two tables and and or. If and and are basically these things that are all conditions are true. 
and the or is one of the condition is true then is true makes sense or means true true then true if or one is false and second is true then true is one is or is false and other condition is also false then it false in an and and one is true and second is true then it true if in it and one is false and second and true then it false if and is a false first condition is false second condition is false then third condition is false now see in or the one of the condition should be true and in and the all condition should be true so this is a basic boolean logic which is used in javascript now guys in this example i am show you the the boy is is between 20 and 30 so now what we do i am putting one more if else in this example Age is greater than 20 and it is less than 24. Now see the soul dot talk you are young boy. Can I save it and show you in my browser? Now see what is the result. Uh, it is getting third <coughs> condition. Oh, is good. Now see, age is greater than twenty-four. Then we we'll solve this this condition. And else, if the age is greater than twenty and age is less than thirty, and the third condition is console this I'll make it it uh, easier understand this program very well now see and edit this program if age is better than 20 and less than 20 and uh, I put it 24. Now see what is it? I'm getting browser. Then you are a boy. Now see this condition is good. In this program, I put if age is less than 20, the first condition is false. Then after it goes to else condition, and if age is greater than 20. And eight are less than thirty. So this condition is true. So now this is a Boolean logic operator are here. And in this operator, the both condition should be true. So it execute. Now this is a Number of boolean conditions. Now I show you the JavaScript switch. First of all, I am show you the definition of switch JavaScript shift statement. Now see what is the switch statement. The switch statement is used to perform different action based on different condition. If uh, switch acceleration codex code a block break case or uh, case or uh, case y uh, break default. In this action, the breaks gives a point that if your above uh, is executed, then it the 
program is break here and it not execute the further inquiry now we are uh, start for going the switch statement in the coding part now we start so guys i am starting the switch in a javascript programming first of all i am defining a variable putting the string value teacher now in switch in switch statement you have to use like you have the value you can uh, define in multiple times like a uh, switch variables because I need to make it, uh, make it define this uh, variable in this position in curly brackets I'm putting the all codes like switch and put job and I want to need this variables to put it different case now I'm putting case 1 teacher control you are a teacher now putting this I'm putting a break if the switch condition is executed on teacher, the uh, the below code is not executed. And put case whatever control dot dog to our driver. If I put case. Put um, teacher driver cook shopkeeper also string. So I'm putting this string. You are so. Put the break here. Now see, I put the old condition here. If any time the job is not equal to this part, I, I, we can also use the default keyword which we use in JavaScript. I put the default. And I put control dot log you are a job person. The default keywords is used that creation are not is good in switch statement then the the uh, console result will be the URA new person now see what is the result in our browser I have some mistake I'm putting uh, 35 uh, pages uh, oh, sorry I'm not putting the case 